I, just to stick on alien life for just a brief moment more, is there is some signs of uh, signs of life on Venus in gaseous form. There's uh, hope for life on Mars, probably extinct. We're not talking about intelligent life. <laughs> Although that has been in the news recently. <laughs> We're talking about basic like, you know, uh, bacteria. Protobacteria. Yeah. Uh, and then also, I guess, uh, there's a couple moons that are, I guess. Europe. Uh, yeah, Eu Europa, which is Jupiter's moon. Yep. I think there's another one. Are you, um, is that exciting or is it terrifying to you that we might find life? Do you hope we find life? I certainly do hope that we find life. Um, I mean, it was very exciting to to hear about uh, you know uh, this uh, news about the the possible life on Venus. It'd be nice to have hard evidence of something with uh, which is what the hope is for for Mars and and uh, Europa. But do you think those organisms would be similar biologically, or would they even be sort of carbon based if we do find them? I would say they. They would be carbon based. Uh, how similar? It's a big question, right? So it's it's you know, the moment we discover things outside Earth, right? Even if it's a tiny little single cell. I mean, there is so much. Just imagine that. That would it's, be so. <laughs> it, I, I think that that would be another turning point for yeah. for the science, you know. And if especially if it's different in some very new way. That's exciting because that says that's a definitive state, not a definitive, but a pretty strong statement that life is everywhere in the in the in the universe. To me, at least, that's that's really exciting. 